Here we go, about to go live Beer in my hand and a dog by my side Tongue out of hell, skills out of heaven Headphones on, stoke level at 11 Here we go, here we go, what will happen? No one knows, so sit back and relax And enjoy the show Happy Monday. Um, thanks for being here. Thanks for everyone for joining me and this big zit on my cheek. <laughs> I was hoping that I could cover it up with makeup and no one would be the wiser. Uh-uh. Hi, Strike. It is so much better when it's spinning. Animated emotes was a huge uh, upgrade. I feel like we don't use a lot of my animated emotes. Um, the Simone Butts is number one. Um, Party I see sometimes, but I don't see a lot of the other ones. Oh, the clap nevermore, that's good. I'm gonna be getting some new ones soon. I need to... Uh, follow up with some people. The drinking one is good because I'm always drinking. The clapping one nevermore. Yeah, it's really good. Is it a bunny? It's got like little ears. I don't know what kind of creature it is, but I do like it. Cinnabunny, okay, I love it. Yes, I'm interested in Cinnabunny as a concept. I enjoyed Dan talking about buying fruit like a kid, being excited by learning how to tie their shoes on fire escape. <laughs> yeah, Dan is so uh, easily amused, um, which I think is what makes him such a joy to talk to on that uh podcasts like uh, oh yeah new fire escape for anyone who didn't know we have a new fire escape today so please go check it out we talked about um uh, i talked about sea of stars a lot i really like sea of stars i played it all weekend um i have really gotten suckered into that game it's very good it's super fun um for a what is that called like a jrpg style like it's really nice um I also played a lot of Pikmin, so I talk about Pikmin, um, and just kind of like a usual, regular old chat about nothing in between the old video game chat. Um, we don't, I don't know if we talk about poop, but I can't confirm nor deny poop talk because it's so consistent on our podcast. I think at any, at any moment, somebody could bring up poop adjacent material, but I do not believe we discuss poop. I, I believe that we are poop free on this episode and I'm proud of that. Hi, Gamer J. Yes, I, uh, I think I incensed Mike twice on this uh, recording, not intentionally. I think sometimes I inadvertently like say stuff without thinking and then it's kind of a knock to Mike. That happens every once in a while. Um, so, for example, 
uh, we're talking about getting old and Mike's like, yeah, I totally hear you on that. And I'm like, I'm so fucking sick of like fresh 30 year olds or like somebody in their late twenties being like, oh, I'm getting old. And it's like, none of us are old yet. You'll know, you'll know because your organs will start failing you and your bones will creak. <laughs> we're not there yet. <laughs> Hey, Uh Oh, okay. That does seem reasonable, Lord. I do think that's possible. Yeah, fire escape sales poop and poop accessories. <laughs> Ass times. I think you'll know when we're old, but we do feel it. Uh, especially, like, uh, Dan talking about his teeth more where he's like, I love candy, but I can't eat it anymore because my teeth are rotting out of my mouth. And it's like, that's something that's we we're getting there when like you got to worry about that. The other day I was like uh, the Kish genetics were notorious for it. Um, my gene pool, everyone in my family that's over like 45 is on heart medication. So blood pressure medication. And it is only a matter of time. And this doesn't matter. I'm sure like diet and exercise help. But statistically, because of my genetics, it is only a matter of time before my butt is going to have to be on some kind of, I don't know, blood pressure medicine. We'll see. I love greasy breakfast. I had brunch this uh, weekend, but I had savory because I almost I almost never do sweet breakfast. I did. Um, I went to a uh, diner. I love. Uh, I call I call them crappy diner, but I do that in a like in a loving way when I say I want a crappy diner breakfast. And that's like when the diner is like old. It's like not fancy. Probably has like some dust on the windows it's pretty casual in nature like that's a crappy diner i love crappy diner breakfast and i got co complimentary crappy diner uh i always get uh eggs sausage links not rounds hash browns and um sourdough toast and then i'll get jam on the side and i'll make little jam toasts and that's my favorite traditional breakfast at the diner Dang, uh, Lemon, it's kind of a bummer to find out through a DNA test what I'm like genetically disposed to. I suppose it's good to know. Uh, there's a reason your doctors always ask you, like, you know, how have your parents, how have your grandparents died? Like, how many people in your family have died from cancer? Like, I have a lot of people in my family that died young from cancer. So that's like something that like lingers in my family somewhere. That's a fantastic question, Nevermore. I get my eggs prepared sunny side up. I do not do over easy or over medium. I don't want them over at all. Sunny side up, baby. Give me that, give me that shine on the top of the egg dome. Because I'm a dunker. I take my toast and I dunk it in the yolk. And I usually add some of the sausage and hash browns onto the toast and I make myself a breakfast sandwich, open-faced, tostada style. And I'll do that for like one piece of toast and then the other piece of toast is for jam. I have a system. Scrambled, I understand. Tostada. <laughs> uh, um, I also like scrambled eggs. I do scrambled eggs when I'm in a giant group. So uh, when I did Mike's bachelor party, um, there was like 17 people in the house. And I was typically the person who made breakfast almost every day. And Jake was my sous chef. I put him on toast. So he was like sitting there next to the toaster, just constantly putting the toast down and then it would come out and he'd put new toast down. And I was like, good job, toast guy. And he was like, I'm on it. Uh, but I always made breakfast and I always made scramby eggs because it's so much faster. And also like a cold 
fried egg is no good. And when you're making 17 people eggs, you can't possibly make 17 sunny side uh, egg, you know, all warm. So scramby is the way to go in a group. Um, I do them really slow and I always add um, spices and a little bit of cheddar, cheddar cheese in there. At the end, at the very, very end, I always add a little bit of cheese. I feel strongly about cheese in my scrambies. It's always good to have a good toast guy around. You want to have a toast guy. And they got to be someone you can trust. They have to have good timing skills. Uh, they can't complain because they're going to be in your kitchen annoying you. Jake was perfect. Good toast guy. I would recommend him. I would write him a referral if he asked. Throw some cheese and bacon in this. Oh, yeah. You know I'd put some bacon bits in the scramby eggs. That sounds so good. Hard-cooked eggs. Ew. Um, I also like those uh, soft-boiled eggs where they're, like, still in a little... They're still in their shell, and then you can, like, dunk toast in them, the toy soldiers. That's my jam, too. You're eating scrambled eggs right now? Are you having breakfast right now? I want breakfast right now. Cool guy, Jake. Um, when I do toast at a crappy diner, it's almost always like store-bought bread. It's not going to be fancy. So I usually get sourdough when given the option. Now, if I'm making it at home, I usually like to have like a nice loaf of bread in the house. But I don't always have a nice lo loaf of bread in the house. Like, let's be real. We don't always carry rustic batards in our house. No scrambies, no scrambies, no scrambies. Um, man, I haven't done a Just Dance stream in a hot minute. I feel like that would be a really fun thing to do. I actually don't know if I've ever even done a Just Dance stream in this office. That seems impossible. I'm sure I've done one once. There's an egg crepe they sell on fairs here, and it's low-key good. I am pro-crepe. Um, but again, because I'm a very savory person, my crepes tend to have chives and bacon and eggs in them. I like savory breakfasts. I'm, it's very rare you will ever catch me in the pancake aisle. I just don't want them. I like uh, hash browns. They're like my number one thing that I like to get at breakfast. It's like, oh my gosh, if they have hash browns, I'm getting hash browns. So good. Happy Monday to you all, uh, breakfast enthusiasts, Monday enthusiasts, and everyone in between. Um, I will be playing a, I believe it's an indie game that I purchased on Steam. My God, I hope it's not on Game Pass. I did some preliminary research. I did not see that it was on Game Pass. Um, this game is called Chance of Sinar. It is a puzzler it looks very pretty. Oh, I've been, I've cut myself off. Oop. I'm doing a terrible job. Oh, I'm making myself really wide. Yes, that's what we want. Good job, Mary. Yes. Don't fix it. Just commit to the bit. Good job. I have made this so much more difficult than it needs to be. Look away, please, everyone. Nobody look. This is my new system. It's called Embarrass Myself Publicly Mondays. Why is this cut off? <laughs> this should not be cut off. I don't understand why this looks the way it does. It should not look like this. There's obviously a left of me. Let me try again. All right. There we go. Technical hurdles galore. Do not look. <laughs> look away <laughs> when I fix my stupid stream. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. User agreement. This is a really fun game. The very beginning of the game is to uh, pretend that you have re read the agreement that sells your soul and then start. I have been told that this game is quite good. I'm excited about it. I don't know a lot about it besides that it is um, possibly about language learning. Like, I think the concept of this game is that you're looking at a language that you obviously don't know and you're deciphering it by solving puzzle juice. Uh, well, this is English, so it started out really easy. Um, I'm quite good at that language. Click on the background to move. You can also choose to play with a controller. Oh shit, I have a controller. Oh, sick. It's got controller support. Alright, let me... I know this is annoying, but I'm gonna immediately go to chat. Reb at IGN is really into it. I think that might be where I have seen it. I think I saw a review or like a preview from IGN where they were kind of like talking pretty highly of it. Also, you know me, I like puzzlers. I'm a big, I'm a fan of puzzle juice. And I like games that have this like visual style. It's simple, but it looks nice. Um, these like thin lines. Apparently I cannot touch water. Go close close to an item and press the action button. This journal will record the glyphs you discover. To open it, press the journal button. Then you can open it and add text. When you think you've guessed the meaning of a glyph, you can select it and add it to your hypothesis. Next to the journal, press the cancel button. Okay. So I don't know yet. I don't feel comfortable yet. It is my assumption that that means close and that means open. And the reason I say that is, is because that door is currently closed and now it's open. So I'm gonna put my hypothesis down. Oh God, I like don't feel confident yet. Sorry, I'm panicking already. Okay, so I'm gonna put close here. Or closed, I don't know. And then this one should be open. And then this is door. What do you think? That seems reasonable. Open, closed door, open door. They seem reasonable. And I think this is gonna come in handy later because as we continue through this, maybe I'll come to a door-esque style glyph and I'll be like, now I understand. You can use the hints button to reveal nearby interactions, which is RB. Oh, I didn't read the rest of it because I hit RB. Um, okay, so this is going to say closed, closed, open, closed, open, closed. All right, so is that the solution to getting rid of the water? That makes a little bit of sense. So closed, closed, open, closed, open, closed. Closed, closed, open. 
closed, open, closed. Nothing happened. Closed, closed, open, closed, open, closed. Closed, closed, open, closed, open, closed. All right, what if it's the opposite? Open. Open. Okay, I'm glad it's not on Game Pass. Closed. This was like in a... S I did some research. I looked on Game Pass. I did not see it. But I've been wrong before. if these are wrong what if closed means open and open means closed what if closed means up 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 down up down up I don't know Oh my god, what is this? All the glyphs on a double page are correct. They will be definitively validated. Use the action button to move each glyph into the slot you think matches it. Okay, so we know this means door. We know that. Like, it wouldn't make any sense. And then I thought... Closed was this one, and open was this one. If the glyphs on a double page are correct, they will be definitively validated. All right, well, validate me then, buddy. God, so I was wrong. Hi, Akadrian. How's it going? How's your jobby? I just got off of my jobby. I basically got the very first puzzle wrong in this game. But I feel that that is just par for the course in a puzzle game. So I will not let it deter me. I try and finish, uh, start my stream right as my work stops at six, but I don't feel like I can always get it right to the minute. Because as we all know, that would mean I'd be opening up my OBS somewhere around 5.55, which is while I'm still working, which is not allowed. Uh, this person's talking to me. I don't know what they're saying. This looks like a smiley face with an open mouth like this. So I'm going to assume that means, hello. Now this bottom one is harder to decipher. Um, some exclamation marks, uh, a phone, and a loop-de-hoop. Uh, hey. Okay. Oh. Open door. Is that what you wanted, bud? Jobby is chilling. Yeah, it's hard. It is very difficult to balance. It took me... Uh... To be honest with you, because I, uh, it's been six years at Twitch now, which is crazy to think about. And uh, I would say it took me over a year, a full year of working, 
to comprehend the fact that I was no longer on camera for my job. And that was very difficult for me to understand and comprehend. And I also didn't like it. And so I was constantly trying to split the difference. In, in that, I mean, I was trying to find hosting ops in my job where I could, because I knew it was a skill I had, and process what it was like to produce a show that I wasn't in, that I ha had nothing to do with me, and do it for the greater good, you know? And that took me a long time to, to get over. But uh -huh. I did it. Um, I, I bet you do. And um, obviously, I don't know exactly how you feel. But my, my thought behind it is it takes time to adjust to your new world. But don't let that deter you. I went through... Honestly, I, I would say my first six months at Twitch, I didn't actually like the job, and I was actually thinking about quitting, which is crazy to think about, because I've actually really enjoyed it overall. But for the first six months, I was like, I don't understand what it is that I'm doing. Okay, so this is high. What? That's not high? I was way off. What, what is that? Is that a prime sub? Is that a prime sub? You smart motherfucker. Thank you. OMG Panic Sonic subbed. Panic, thank you so much for the prime sub for two months in a row. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. Um... I, uh, anyway, I just wanted to like be transparent that it took me months to comprehend the job and like what it was going to be like for me. And I hope it's very good for you. I don't think it's a simple answer. I think it can be very difficult, but I wish you a lot of luck with your transition and like with the whole process. Cause it is, it's a, it's a joy to figure out. All right. So smiley face is hello, neutral face is you, and that is me. Yeah, I think that's, uh, you found a, a great middle ground, um, and I, uh, I applaud you for that. I think that's great. I wonder if I would have enjoyed doing more of a middle ground when I first started at Twitch. Because uh, I missed hosting so Hello? much. I felt like I wasn't... I wasn't always doing, like, the best job. Hello. But I... Eventually, I learned how to figure it out. Time is your friend. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, Clay. I find that to be hey. such a consistent thing uh, around a lot of businesses right now. And my dad used to always warn me about the ebb and flow of uh, companies when money is tight uh -huh. and when it's more lucrative. Um, I think we're, we, at least in my experience, I came from a place where I was like, hey, we have some money, you know, we can, we can play around with it a little bit. And this last year, it is essentially like, everyone be frugal, be extremely careful about every penny you spend, think about it, seriously think about it. Um, I've never, this is like going back to a time where I'm like, everyone be very careful about the money that we're spending and why. And it's, it's where we're at. I do like Twitch public access a lot. Obviously, I enjoyed um, I enjoy that show, but I also think it's one of the very few times where we get to do something to celebrate the community. And I think it would be a mistake not to. Um, I would be disappointed if we didn't do anything that was like, what did the community do that kicked ass this month?
not for profit healthcare. Yeah, this is a tough year. Um, shockingly enough, tech is also having uh, a pretty weird year. I feel like that's been pretty consistent across the board. Manifold Garden, Sable. Uh, sometimes I feel like it has that, um, oh, what was that game called? It was called like Hypercube or like Anti Puzzle, an Anti something, Anti Chamber. Oh, I got it. Remember Anti Chamber? Anti Chamber was a puzzler that had like thin lines. Mm. Hypercube. You can see how I got there, though. <laughs> you can you can see the the wheels in my in my head. Antichamber was a cool concept. Uh, it was a really neat game. Oh, never nevermore. I'm sorry to hear. Yeah, I have uh, several friends, uh, especially after the Twitch layoff, who are still actively looking and I think it's a really tough job market right now so these are ones where I'm allowed to guess um, oh, actually, this is missing a middle. Okay, so it's broken. So I would suggest that it's possible that this has to do with sun. Um, possibly crops, although I'm not sure if those are crops or just trees. Um, it could be about praying because it kind of looks like they're praying to the sun. So um, I'm going to do like a little guess here that. This could be sun, but I don't know. Um, I'm also going to say L could be respect or pray. I don't really know. Hyper light drifter. It makes sense. I could see where your head went. Intelligence cube. Respect. Sun. Respect. Respect. Sun. Sun. I mean, we'll see. It's probably not right, but there's nothing wrong with doing the old guesserino. See? It's like more praying. I think that God could be in this. There's something very, like, God about this, so I'm just going to do God. Oop, I accidentally made it go. Um, and then... I don't know what this one is. This could be God. This could be love. This could be... I don't know. There's not enough to decipher here, but we'll figure it out. Um, celebrate or joy, maybe that felt kind of joyous, didn't it? Happy, happy, joy, joy. Oh man, we have to do that. Where are you? Not before I type it. You 
got to be fast around here to make a joke. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy, joy. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun. I know about civilization. Hi! This is the Run and Stimpy game in Koja. Alright, more deciphering. Joy, joy, God. That is Temple. Temple. Or like House of God, I don't know. They never had the joys of vlog. Okay, so those are um, pyramid heads. Night. There's like a night. There's like a nighttime situation because this is. Oh my god, I'm not going to know what this is. There's no way I'm going to know what this is. I suck at this. Uh, okay, so I believe this is temple. Um, these were bad men. Oh, I am in trouble. I don't know. Also, do they want me to put this here because it's like God or do they want temple here? This is going to be so hard for me to decipher. All right, let me think some more. Um... There's so much to unpack in these. Okay, so we have to figure out what these people mean. These people are like LLs. This is an L. Uh, and the LLs praise God. And then these guys are Lolos. And they, the Lolos, go to the temple to pray. Although, now that I think about it, I wonder if this is what it wants me to put there. Oh my god, okay, cool. Alright, we're getting there. Alright, I understand. Alright, so I was right about a couple things. This is God. Okay, so this is a regular person. They they become followers. Then the warriors go against those sometimes. And it's all revolving around God. Hey, Tolkoto! Can I get a shout out to Tolkoto, please? I'm deciphering a language right now. Um, it's a very serious, learned 
skill. Um, you know, I don't expect you to be able to comprehend, you know, books and stuff. God is an upside down kite. Yes. That is probably what this game wants you to get out of it. Oh my god. You door. No, me man. You triangle head. The warriors locked the door. It's very important. Um, high rank, uh, high skill, high probability of failure. Everyone agrees. Um, I do not comprehend. I understand. I suspect as much. Uh, do your best. Okay. God. Temple. Oh, no. Me, me, temple. You, me, me. Oh, my God. Okay. So, this is the words I haven't deciphered yet. <laughs> So, I don't know. Uh, the phone, I feel like, was like maybe follow. Um, that's this bottom one that looks like a little ring a ding. Um, and then the one in the middle that looks like knees. Um, me, me, something temple. God temple. Oh, I am not gonna be good at this oh my god god temple me temple warrior warrior devotee devotee warriors locked the door all right so the gist of it did you say looks like knees yes knees it's pointy i'm a devotee god love me god is in the temple I, and I wonder if he's saying, want to go to the temple. That is my assumption of what's happening here. Um, all right. In fact, I'm going to open this up because I'm learning. So I think the knees mean go to. Where are these knees? They're there. Go. Uh, what else did I want to? Me go, and then what do you think that like circle piece means? It's like a little J circle. Um. Oh, this one. I'm just gonna put to the and see if it makes sense grammatically anywhere else, and it might not. But that's a part of the game. Me go to the temple. God temple. God love me. I'm a devotee. And then, like, let's see if... Uh, let's see if it makes sense with any of the other conversations I'm having. You know what I mean? God's in the temple. Me go to the temple. Warriors. And see this, like... E -er -e. It looks like a... It looks like a math symbol. I'm going to say that that math symbol means stop or prevent. You know what I mean? Warrior stops me. Warrior lock the door. That's what I think uh, we're reading. Uh -huh. This is like the last one. Just to make sure I think I understand what's going on. God temple. Me go. So it could be. What if knees means want? Oh my god, I fucking love Tunic. Um, I'm gonna say, all right, we're learning a lot here. I'm gonna say this actually means want. And I could be wrong, but that's what I think. And then uh, I'm gonna say that the phone means help. Oh, if it's need, I'm going to lose it. Ah. And 
And I'm going to make this go. Go to. Hi, you've been gamed. All right. God is in the temple. Me want to go to temple. You help me, me. I wonder why they keep saying me, me. All right. So now we understand each other a little bit better. Mm -hmm. You stop to the door. Warriors lock the door. So that doesn't totally make sense, but. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, my God. Are we playing a game? Oh. I don't understand. Is this rock, paper, scissors? Yes. Okay. So, devotee is higher than the human. Warrior is higher than the devotee. God is... All right, that's warrior, baby. All right, so warrior, so that's me winning. This is... I am learning this game as we go here, people. Okay, devotee. Human, I win again. I fucking rule at this game. Give me all the balls. I won. Suck it. I wonder how you say suck it in their language. I'm going to have to learn so that I can tell them when I've won. I wonder how you say uh, GG easy. It is funny though, like, you have the ability to do something really funny, which is, are you gonna talk to me? Oh, that guy uh, shut me straight out. You have the ability to do something funny here, which is like alter the text so that they say what you want them to say. You want me? Maybe want is need. Oh my God, is it need? What if it's follow? Hey, Danimal, we love the bills here. Thank you, big fan of the bills. Where did this child go that told me that, uh, I don't know where he went. Hi, thanks for the follow, Bacon. Need. Where did this child go? Oh, here he is. All right, that looks like a boob. Um, I'm gonna say that the boob means follow. I do want you. Where is this kid? There you are. Oh, what if it's find? Find and found? What if boob means Found. That would make a lot of sense. Oops. You found me. And I wonder if knees is get.
looking for a little kid. Looking for a child. Oh, there he is. <laughs> you boobed me. <laughs> oh, my God. Me, stop. Me to the bye. Oh my god, I don't know. It's like that little people in a box house. Um I don't know what that is. I'm going to say house or home. Me, stop. I don't know what that one is. Oh, playing makes sense. I'll do play for now. And I don't think it's to the, I think it's go to. Hiding makes sense too. All right, so he opened up a little hidey hole for me. Okay, <clears throat> so want which i think is actually seek uh found and then uh oh my god i have no idea what this last one is cuz it looks like they're just walking One is go, yes. Yes! Smart. It was go. Uh, then seek, want, find. We are so smart. Look at us. Devotee, stop. You, me. You, me, go past temple. Um. Okay. So this is like a sneaking situation. <laughs> okay, so there's like a... There's like a sneak around, sneak em situation going on here. Hide along the walls with the left stick. B to cancel and return to free travel.
That was pretty close. Got away with it, though. So, that one might be sneak or something. Yeah. Um, I saw it on Twitter, and I downloaded it on Steam. This game is on sale. This game is currently $17. It's on sale for 10% off, and it just came out on Steam. Um, Mimi, go, uh, Mimi, stop going to the temple. They close the door, but I want, uh, and then there's like a word here. Um, It's amazing. Um, <laughs> they let me fill it in. Mimi, seek that butt. Yeah, me too. You know it. High five. Oh my god, this reminds me of those old, uh, what are those ones where they would ask you for like uh, a noun and like an adjective and you would just put sex stuff in there and a wacky Mad Lib. Yes, me and my sisters used to do that all the time. What are the ones that are all question marks? We should just put stuff in here. That's funny. Um, obviously, it's got to be the classics. Pooh. These all have stuff in them. When we get new ones, we'll add stuff in them. Oh. Um, we did butt. Pooh. Um, this one probably needs to be... Sex stuff. Um, I think we do better. Let's do titties. And we'll see what happens. I don't I didn't have any adjectives though. Those are all nouns. I should have had like honk honk or like squeezes. You know, I never really thought about it. Hi. Me, stop, go past Temple, close the door. I want that butt. He wants a key. That butt is a key. Uh, a little bit of resi, a little Resident Evil here. <laughs> you find that butt. You me play. <laughs> you know it. <laughs> kind of want to keep it as that butt. Because the key is that butt. Oh my god, Clay. We're on the same page. So far, I really like it. Okay. Some... Uh, uh, and elements can be combined. Combine them, activate the element, choose your item, and press the action button again. So far, it's a light puzzler. It's nice to look at, and um, it's kind of my jam of a game. Like, I don't always want to play games like this. Uh, this is like my style of puzzly game. Titties? Um, shit. I don't know if I've ever... Okay, stop is probably one of these. I think it's this one. Um... I believe that butt is key. Um... I think house wouldn't be that one... Play could be free. <laughs> Poo. 
<laughs> I mean, this could be anything. We have not thought this through. Uh... <laughs> I don't know. Set the titties free. <laughs> Play titties <laughs> poop butt. <laughs> we have been, we've been fucking around this whole game and now it's coming to haunt me. That butt opens all the doors, all the gates. Um, I, this is what happens when you don't take this game seriously. Um, I believe that for the record, I believe that stop is accurate. I think that is correct. I think we have the right one there. I have no idea if Pooh is in the right spot. I am suffering. None of these are temple. Technically, that one could be sun, but I don't think so. I am really, really, really lost. I don't think that bud is in this one. I think... I think it's like titties. I don't think it's play either. It wouldn't make sense for either of these to be love. I think these are ones that we haven't deciphered yet. So it's like poo and titties. I'm like, they're both interchangeable. I feel really stuck. I think I need more. I'm like totally not sure. Is this last one a ghost? I need more hieroglyphics to understand. Who could have known that putting in fake words for a language would have such dire consequences? Now I have no idea what I'm doing. This makes sense. God loves you and me. No notes. Freedom makes sense as a word, but I don't know which one could possibly have been freedom. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Okay. Okay.
brain juice time, baby. Let's get that brain juice popping, you know what I mean? I'm not sure if I know what the goal is. Um, there's also a bird's nest distracting me. I don't know if you guys have seen that. There's like a bird's nest going on here. Uh, I wonder which one means freedom. I suck at this. Um, we're gonna figure this out. I thought the goal was to get on this ladder, but now I actually don't know what the goal is. So I can move this shit around all day. The question is, is like, what am I, what am I doing? Because see how the wheels only lets me, the wheels only lets me move this left and right. I thought the goal was to get it closer to, um, the scaffolding, but it can't go north. It can only go east. This only goes left and right. Oh my god, I understand. I understand. It's to get the bird's nest. It's to get the bird's nest. I understand. I was confused. I thought it was to get to these uh, purple, uh, I don't know. They're not really roofs. Awnings, thank you. I was like, what are they? That's what I thought the skull was. Okay. I have a coin. Oh man, I still don't have an answer for this one. It's driving me crazy. That one has to be stopped. I refuse to pretend it's anything else. I'm suffering with this puzzle. This one is like, I don't fucking no. This I think is shop or buy. I'm going to go with shop for now. Ooh. Hello. 
Me, shop shop. You, bye bye. Um. Hello. Me, shop shop. You. Oh god, I don't know. Oh my god, I don't know. I'm the I am starting to not do well. Hi piano. I'm like struggling with language as usual. So he says, "Hello. Uh I am a shop. You <gasps> buy." Or maybe music? Like, who's to say? Like, these could all be wrong. That's the problem. Thank you! Uh... Uh, you know what? I'm going to change my mind. I think the circle means sell. That's what I think. And then I think that is... Music. Or instruments. I don't know. Oh, that's awesome, Piano. I'll see you there. Um, I, uh, I have fun news. My parents are coming. My parents are going to fly to Las Vegas to see, uh, maybe to, like, learn what I do for a living or something. I'm not really sure. Uh, pots. Pottery. And you know, what if it's not sell? What if it's, uh, make? I make pottery. You want pottery. Everybody wants pottery. Fuck! I thought this was it. I thought I had it. All right, so... God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I should be able to uh 
go and meet people at various places. I obviously do, my number one obligation is the Glitch Theater, which is why I'm there most of the time. I'm on a panel and my parents are going to be there on Sunday, but it would be very nice to meet you. So I do think we can make it work. Um, we'll have to figure it out for sure. But um, I am definitely on a panel, which would make sense. And uh, I'm down for high fives and hugs. So bring it on. So one of these, oh, play maybe? I'm frustrated that this isn't right. I would have thought make was the bottom left. Yes, being on the panel makes it pretty obvious that that's where I'll be. Oh, I'm doing so bad. I really thought that that was right. That butt, that butt. Ah, that's pretty funny. It's still good. Alchemy? I don't even know if that's how you spell it. I'm frustrated that I'm so off about the music one. I really thought that one was accurate. That's like disappointing to me that that was wrong. God damn it, all these goddamn symbols, and I don't know what any of them means. I'm in danger. Out of my way, birds. I feel like they need more like dum dum puzzles for dum dums. Am I playing? Genuinely have no idea what that means, what it represents, what it's doing, nothing. Cool. What was that? What was that all about? All right, this is a graveyard. I'm pretty sure. looks gravy to me. I'm good. I'm uh, enjoying this game very much. I don't know what that triangle means, but we're getting there. Titties, you and me. <laughs> oh, fuck.
mean, this is probably a puzzle too, but I don't know what it's supposed to. I don't know if I have the information to do this puzzle yet. Um, I have a Discord channel for the community, actually. There is a Discord. Thank you, Silver. It mostly posts when I'm live, but I also uh, generously accept anybody talking about the podcast, their animals, um, what's going on at Twitch, and Thank you. general thoughts. Nildy, thanks for the follow. I'm missing a lot here, but this might be par for the course for this game. Like What this wants me to do, I wouldn't possibly no. I'm also, I have to say, I'm upset that this wasn't right. Like, how is this not right? This was clearly pottery. I'm like mad that I got that wrong. I'm gonna go back. Yes, an art channel. We support our fellow artists. I might have to make a, a drink. It's very hot uh, up here today. I am sweaty. Hi. You man human temple me something you i'm gonna do help oh fuck me um Okay, God is highest, then warrior, then devotee. I learned that in school. Mm -mm. Okay, they don't talk to me. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> what did I do wrong? Me seek want love. <clears throat> Me seek want love from God. <sighs> me, me, stop, find. Oh my God, I don't know what any of this means. Pray? That's the only thing I can think of. Or praise, you know what I mean?
I don't know. Is they want me to try and get through? Is that the idea or no? Like, how do I know how this works? Nice to meet you too, Flash. Oh my god, I got in. Oh no! Pray love. Ah, oh, you did unlock an emote. There's a lot more that came from Tolkodo. I have some really good emotes. Check out my uh, tier five emotes. <laughs> Pretty nice, huh? Warrior help poo is what scrawled on the wall of the toilet in the Taco Bell. <laughs> Listen, learning a language is some highbrow stuff. And to really understand a language, you do need to be able to decipher human help poo. this wants. One of my issues right now is that I don't know what I'm solving. It does look like crosshairs on Mike. He deserves it. Sun titties. Sun titty warrior. So what? Sun titties me. Yes. Uh, subscribe. That button. I shouldn't have fucked around with these words. I don't know. I have no fucking idea. I need more information to decipher this too. I'm like doing a bad job deciphering these. This is a really cool puzzle, but I feel like I'm missing key information in order to solve these. Warrior open door. Devotee. Go door. Open door. Love door. Titties door. Warrior, open that butt. You know what I mean. I don't know. I need more information. I'm doing a really bad job. I obviously don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I need to come back. 
But I am learning a lot. I just don't understand what these... So, like, I understand there's four puzzles there that are connecting four dots of, like... Mm -hmm. I need... I need four sentences. Uh -huh. Me help music. Oh. Maybe help is play. Hey. Or like? What if help is like? Because that person isn't playing music. They're just liking it. I'm so confused because I thought I genuinely thought I had it. I like I was so sure that I understood this game and I felt really smart 10 minutes ago. And now I'm at rock bottom. I suck. And I don't understand why this is so hard. I feel like I had it and it's really frustrating. I don't know, should music be on the bottom? Like music is definitely one of these, right? And then what's the top one? <sighs> Bapanada. See how he's enjoying the music? Uh -huh. I don't think he's helping music. I think he likes music. Or listen. I think help is play. That's what I think. That's what I think. Wait, I have two plays? Oh, fuck me. Oh, God. How about enjoy? Grave. Oh, I feel so fucking stupid. I really thought I had it. I've tried poo. I've tried titties. I've tried everything.
but I don't need to have the right word. I just need to have the right uh, symbol next to the photo for it to decipher it for me. If that makes sense. Language is hard and I'm, I'm suffering. But hopefully over time I can get better. Oh shit. Speak, touch, look. Oh my God. I mean, I don't know any of these. I'm in deep shit. God enjoy you, me. Uh, what if enjoy is touch? My fucking God. I'm too stupid for this. Okay, so grave. Is there. We know that. It's grave. Um, we know pottery is this. Uh, I don't know, but I'm going to say that's a temple. I'm just... Uh, no! I don't know! I don't know! I don't know! I'm doing such a bad job! I don't know! I don't know! I don't know! This is pottery. I need this game for dummies. This person is a horticulturist, for sure. Sun, sun, poo. Me, stop, enjoy, sun, poo. All right, so they're upset. See how they're looking at the plant? And they're shaking their head. Something's wrong. not enough poop in these plants. Pray stop something. Me stop find pray. Sun sun poo. Me stop enjoy. Sun sun poo. Oh god I'm so out of it. I need a couple of like definite answers. I'm really struggling. I have way too many unknowns right now. Like, Thank you. predominantly what I'm being faced right now is unknowns. Uncle, thank you for the follow. I need 
need more... Huh? Hello, we know that. Me make... Oh. Oh, I think I understand what happened. I think I got shop and music confused. I think this is music. I mean, I think. Damn, I feel like we're close. I, I feel like I'm close, but I can't figure it out just yet. Hi, I make instruments. You want music. Oh God, I don't know. It's like, oh fuck, in extra meant seems right, right? Like, hi, I make instruments, you enjoy music. Or songs. But what's frustrating is that this isn't right. So I obviously still have something wrong. Despite the fact that I felt really fucking strongly about it. It's a raid. Pat Bear, hi. I'm suffering. Uh, with this language game. Saj, what are you talking about? I'm trying to decipher this language and I'm doing a bad job. I make pottery, pottery. You seek, want pottery. Thank you for the shout out to Pat Bear. We love Pat Bear. So this game is about deciphering the language that I do not understand. Everything that is in bold white has been a con... Oh. <laughs> is a confirmed word. Everything in gray, I am guessing. So here's my language. And I'm talking to these people. And see, uh, I think this person's saying, you seek want pottery, right? That's what I think this person's saying. I make pottery. And so I'm assuming that this like parentheses S means pottery. Where is it? This. And so then I'm putting it under the photo of pottery. <laughs> and the hope is, is that if I get this page correct, and I'll show you an example of a page I actually got right. Here's a page I actually got right. It hard bolded the words and was like, you are correct. My freaking issue is, is that despite the fact that I felt so confident that these were the right words, it's not bolding them, which means they're wrong. And it's, oh my God, I got it. Okay, can we all agree that the word make under the pottery is f 
fucking rude and that that should have been pottery. Great. So make and create is now bolded. Music is now bolded and instrument is now bolded. And so we've figured out three words in our dictionary. That's what this game is. There's other puzzles too, but I think that's the, the main meat of it is like deciphering. And now uh, when I talk to them, every word should be bolded. Oh, okay, it's not. Oh, I never figured out pottery. Um, I'm assuming that that's pottery, but we know that he's saying me make and create. Or I may create, so. You'd have like some leniency with it. <laughs> I've also made up terms when I have no idea what a symbol is and it's punished me greatly. So this is the that butt, that butt memorial. Oh look, it's got a giant key. Everybody head to the butthead <laughs> gymnasium. God, I wish I didn't let the kids name that. Anyway, now you're all cut up. That's what this game is. I'm essentially walking around, uh, talking to people, guessing what I think they're saying. Um, I would say a massive chunk of this game is just guessing. And I am being wrong. I'm wrong a lot in this game. I guess they don't do anything. They just go in a circle. I've been already. So this is the horticulturist. Um, what I've learned is that they're looking at this plant. It's very trial and error. And they're shaking their head. So they're unhappy with something. And when I talk to them, what they're generally saying to me, but I don't actually know, is like something's wrong. They need to find something. So prey might not be the right word. It might be like, I have, I don't know. And then I, I've added the poo. That's not probably right. Um, so like, I don't know what he wants because I, I, I don't know enough about the language yet. And I also like assumed a lot there. Like I assumed that he wanted something about the sun, but I actually, the, the word sun could be wrong. And so like, here's really the key here. The key is figuring out what are on these pages. And that's what's been really hard. Um, I have tried, I've tried shouting. I've tried yelling. I've tried spitting. Um, nobody will listen to me. And they keep saying, uh, that this is a Wendy's. So like, here's another really good example. Yeah, I've been like putting random words in there because I'm a degenerate. So this person is nodding their head and they're listening to this person play music. And when I talk to them, they say, and I put the word enjoy. It seems like what they're saying is, is I like music. Doesn't that seem reasonable that that word me enjoy music, right? So like I went to this word here, down here, and I guessed enjoy, but it could be wrong. It could be uh, love or seek or something like that. And so that's kind of the heart of this game is like you're walking around making assumptions and then you're putting those assumptions to the test, I guess. Um, I need to find a different area because I am very stuck in this area. Like, I, I feel like I've done everything I can. So I'm just going to try and go to a totally different space. I do not have to guess the word at all. 
That's the crazy part, Koja. The only thing I have to do is put the right symbol on the right circle. So, for example, if this bird needed help and that was what I was doing, that would be correct. But I have to get all the symbols on this page accurate before they'll tell me. And then they'll tell me what it is. When I write it in there, that's just for my muscle memory to be like, oh, right. This looks like X. Okay, this is the graveyard. So, like, here's a good one. You're seeking God. Blank help you. And also, these are bolded, so that's accurate. You're seeking God, question mark, is accurate. What isn't accurate is help. It's very Oberdin, which I also was so fucking bad at. Um, help is not bolded, so I've assumed that the, the telephone-looking symbol is help. You is bolded, so that's accurate. And I haven't even guessed what the triangle is. So, like, you're seeking God... Something help you. And it's a... It's a... Grave with a sun on it. So is it... Like, something that it could be is... The sun will help you. Because see how it has sun right there? Yeah, titties. So, like, that's kind of, like, where this is at. And this might be wrong, but I'm going to put sun because of that connection, right? But that could be, that could be wrong. So that's like one of the issues I'm facing right now is that I, like, I don't, I don't freaking know what I'm doing. God titties, you and me. Uh, I shouldn't have put fake words in here. I don't think I have enough uh, knowledge to do this either. So I'm going to leave. Yarks, I am suffering. Also, I haven't showed you guys this yet. This is like a whole another like can of worms. Like what the frick is this? It's like some kind of futuristic pong. I, I don't know what this is. I don't know how to interact with it. I know. I feel so silly right now. Um, all right. I need way more time to think this through. color palette is beautiful in this game. It's a very good looking game. I just don't understand what's happening. <laughs> ah, that's a good... Oh, that's good. Okay, so this person... I'm not allowed to... They're not allowed to see me. they do anything about it? <laughs> 
Yeah, and I don't know, like, what if, like, there was more for me to uncover here? I don't know. Like, there's just... They have a different fucking language? No! Oh my god, I'm too stupid. I'll never be able to do this. That's so difficult. Oh no, a whole second language. I'm a devotee. God loves me. God's in the temple. I want to go to the temple. No temple for you. Warriors locked the door. Like, we're getting there. I just, I don't think it's, I'm not very good, and I'm kind of, like, doing a bad job. Oh, right, I don't want to play this game again. We'll play it, but I don't really care. Uh-oh, I lost. No, wait, I won. I'm the best. I won, I'm the best. This is like so luck based, it's crazy. I won, I'm the best. Like, should I not be back here? Have I already have I already solved this area? Is that I feel like I've solved this area. Yeah. All right, I think I need to go back to the new area. Like I was right, I'm in the right, I was in the right area, I just need to figure it out. go anywhere else or no all right and then this kid was looking for a key and we found it it's very much like Oberdin. um i wasn't very good at Oberdin, and unfortunately i'm not very good at this game either i'm kind of suffering right now like i wish i was a little better at decoding Sometimes games like this inadvertently make me feel so dumb. So like, here's one. Oh God, get out of here. So one of the ones I'm working on now. Oh, stop it. Uh. That's correct. This we haven't figured out yet. 
there are certain ones I feel comfortable with. Like, I'm pretty sure, but I, I was wrong last time, that stop was this. I felt like that was stop, because I saw people saying, like, you can't go, f f like, past here. And he's giving me the old wag of the finger. Oh, I feel like I could use, like, a guide in Oberdin, and then I would do it. But I never found a word that felt like escape or free, right? Like, I never felt like I understood that. And I also never remember a word that felt like up. And that's why I'm really stuck here. Um, so I think maybe we just need to, like, do more th thoughts. Me make, and then I made the assumption that parentheses S is pottery. And I feel pretty fucking strongly that that's accurate. Now, I'm pr also pretty sure that that but that but isn't accurate. So my guess is that's, like, locksmith or key. So, we should probably alter that, but that, but. Uh, to key. Yeah, I do feel a little stuck right now. Like right now, I'm I'm like ultra stuck. I've been going around the same area for like 20 minutes. Huh? Hello. I make instruments, you, and then I assume this says enjoy music, but I don't know. Because we can't fucking figure it out. And then look at this one. Like, have I even seen eyes? I don't think so. I bet you it's more obvious. Oh, I think I'm starting to pick something up. I don't think that this is love. Do you see how this is a, a statue of a person with an open mouth? I think this is like speaks. Do you know what I mean? So I'm pretty sure Okay, I think we've figured this one out. Okay, this isn't love, it's like speak. Or talk, talk? And, it, and you can see like, I'm kind of doing it based on this and there's, I'm pretty sure there's four of these, so let's find the other statues. I forget where they all are. That's the other problem is like a huge part of this is like me walking around aimlessly being like, where was that other statue? Like I forget where all the statues are. But I think, I think that speak is right. Like that's the closest I think I've come to being like, yes, that's accurate. No, there is no banana yellow in the new shirt because banana yellow is not in space. That was my uh, justification. And I don't know if it's right, but that was what I said. I'm worried that it would like not look good. Okay, this is watches. So it's not titties, it's watches.
Um, but I applaud you for your banana yellow love because you know I love me some banana yellow. I was all about it. Um, I've been hyping up that banana yellow for the rest of my days. I'm afraid that if people get the new shirt and banana yellow, it won't look as good as we want them. Should I just allow it in banana yellow? Thank you! Like, I don't care, but I, I thought it would look nicer. I did I? Watch out. Dead, thank you for the follow. Um, this is also a puzzle, but I don't know what it is yet, right? Like there's... There's like a devotee. Right? This is a devotee. And they are looking at this guy who's looking at this guy who's looking at this guy. I don't know. Like something's going on, but I don't know enough about it to solve this yet. Or maybe this person wants a key? Because these guys said they wanted a key. That's what they said. They were like, we want a key to get into the house or something. I have no idea. All right, but anyway, we're getting the eyes. There, there was another one that said God, and it had hands, which means touches us. So we can figure out touch from that. We're getting there. We're going to solve this crime. <laughs> Where did God touch you? I think it's in here. Oh, there's something. See how this has stuff written on the wall, too? God, stop. <laughs> God, I shouldn't have just named these things random things. <laughs> uh, I really should have thought this through. Divine constipation. Oh, here it is. See? Touch. God. And I said enjoy, but I think it's touch. God touches you and me. That's what I think. I mean, look at the giant fucking hands. Uh, it's this one. Touch. God enjoys touching. <laughs> All right. That's right. So the only one I don't know is this last one. Hug. This hug one. And I think it's love. Or something. It's not alchemy. Is it poo? I don't think it's temple. Oh shit. Talk is this one. Uh do have I learned 
I would think that the symbol's in here. Because it's like, they would give me what I, what I need to do it. I'm frustrated. I feel like I'm so close. Did I try all of them? I mean, at this point, it's like, it's one of these. Right? Damn it, I did it again. The hug one is so weird. Am I missing a statue? Oh, ew. There's a key in a You want to pray, go pass. Hey, you. Wait, something weird happened. You got to go pass the S box. What's that? I didn't even put a name on it. Hi, Hypno. Damn. I feel like I'm totally stuck right now. <laughs> Me seek, want, talk, pray. I want to talk to God. Oh. Uh, and we don't know the answer to this one yet either. Like there's some things that I feel like I'm starting to get the hang of, but I still don't understand what this area wants from me. There's, there's things about it that I feel like I'm close. There's a key in a striped vase. I don't think that's going to help me. Who touched sun? I feel like I'm not doing a very good job here. I need like a key or something for this area. I'm not. Oh, God damn it. Do I have to wait until they come back? I have to find a striped pot. That's like the next thing. Where would a striped pot be? Oh, there's a pottery area. Maybe it's in there. I think the pottery area is over here.
Okay. Oh, this one. Okay. Not that one. Not that one. Just so many striped goddamn pots. Fucking hell. Right, it's one of these bastards. Oh my god. You're gonna make me check every pot? It looks... Like this. Cute bastards. No, why'd they make so many striped pots? It had multiple stripes, like this one. Oh, god damn it. Could it be one of these, too? Oh my god, it could be. Uh... It has a stripe in the middle, a stripe on top, and a, and a butt stripe. Does that help? Like this one. Oh, this one has a stripe in the middle, a stripe on the bottom. Yes. We fucking did it. We progressed the game. I'm so proud of us. I'm so proud of us. Moving right along. Thank you, Silver. OMG Savvy TF subbed. And we'll always be friends forever. That is a victory. That's like... OMG Perry Social subbed. The best victory I've ever had. All right, a sun dial. Oh God, okay, we know alchemy is this one. Me find something, something find God. Me go past grave, me go past temple, pray. Okay, so I have this thing and it's gonna, oh, the grave has that symbol. So I think I need to go to the grave. To the graveyard! Oh, I know. Fox and the Hound is like so devastating. I love to punish myself, and now you do too. Alright, so we're going towards the graveyard. I think this is the way the graveyard is. O 
Okay. Tell me that doesn't look like that. What do I do with it? OMG, Luis Trevelyan 006. Luis, thanks subbed. for subbing. Well, 42 months. I haven't been very present the last few months, but it's impressive to see how much time has passed. Smiley face. Luis, I appreciate you very much. I am glad you spend time here. Um, and I agree, it is always wild when time passes. Like, what do I do with this thing? I have this, like, cool little device, and I don't know what to do with it. I thought this was my next move, and now I'm a little confused. Because, like... Moving this around doesn't really do anything. Uh, also, uh, was this the sundial? I don't really even remember. Oh, I think I had a word for key. And I think I had a word for pottery too. Oh, I fucking nailed that one. Yes. All right, so at least we got a, a page done, so that's good. Hey, Moon, I like it. I will say it is a very difficult game, and I'm suffering through it, but I think it is not because the game isn't good. I think it's because it's a very difficult puzzle game, and you need to be interested in language learning because, like, a huge part of it is, like, here's a bunch of symbols. I don't know what the fuck they mean, and then you're just kind of hoping that you – assumed the right word, right? Like, look at this one, this is good. If it's bold, it means I've confirmed that that's the right word. I found the lens. The lens found God. Me go grave. I, the reason it's not bolded is because actually that might not be the right word, but I'm pretty sure it is. Me go temple, pray. So I'm assuming because of this that the next move was this graveyard. But now that I'm here, I actually don't know what to freaking do, which is frustrating. I have this, but I don't know what to do with it. It's the same symbol on here. And it's, I think that that word means sun, but I could be wrong. Can I use it? How do I use my sundial? You know what I mean? Like, I don't know how to use my sundial in this situation. Also, I can turn these, but like, why and how is super debatable as well. Um, there's so much going on here, and I, I just don't know what this game wants. If you look, there's an arrow in front of their feeties, so it wants me to point them in a certain direction. But the direction is as good as a guess. I don't know the direction. I do know that these are different characters, and I've learned this in my book. Um, oh, I think I have a word for plant. No, I might not. Watch out. <laughs> it's definitely not poo.
Oh, I have two words for sun right now. So one of these is wrong. Um... And then this one is wrong too, which really bothers me. So speak, touch, sight, and then I actually don't know what this upper right one is. Hug. This isn't right either, and it's driving me crazy. I feel like sometimes this game makes me feel like I'm a Fucking idiot. Oops. Why don't I try again? All right. Let's put touch here. We know... We know which one is... We know this is talk. Oh my fucking god, I got it. How could you assume this is not touch? Like, this game sometimes. Help? How is it not touch? Alright, cool. Well, we figured that out, so that's good. And then I couldn't figure this one out either. This one's also... You're lifting the person up. It looks like you're touching them! Anyway. Um, I felt like this one was stop. But I can't prove that. Um, and then I have no idea what these other ones are. You know, like I have no idea if one of these is house or... The only one that I felt mildly conf like confident about was stop. And it's because this little symbol is often used by the guys with the triangle heads to be like you can't go f you can't go past here. So that's why I think that one is stop. And and that could be wrong too. That's the crazy part. All these could be wrong. Hey, Camaro. And it won't confirm them until all three are right. But, like, what's this arrow going up? What is that? Like, we're close, you know? This is this was, like, the beginning of the game. Climb or ascend makes sense. I don't think it's temple or house. I don't think it's play. I don't know that one, so it could be that one. I don't think e any of these are grave. Um, and I don't think these are prey either. Sun was a guess. But now that I have two suns, I'm like... You know what I mean? It's like, who's to say? Uh, these, this book, these pages, no, they don't make a phrase. So like, for example, I determined on this one that, uh, let me see if I can find the corresponding pieces. Music was the upper right. And then I think the one below it is instrument. And then pottery is the one on the right. Oh, make and create was on the right. So th that doesn't make a phrase. Hey, Jalen Ninja. I'm trying to learn this language. It's going okay. So like some of these are going better than, like I am confident that that's grave. So like that seems accurate. Um,
this seems like a house, right? Which one is a temple, right? Is like hard to determine. And then also like, how do I determine what is like a shop and things like that? That's also like, I don't know. Let me know, Camaro. I will be there, obviously. Uh, and I'm doing a panel on Sunday. Uh, and I will be doing opening ceremony on Friday. Got some fun stuff planned for opening ceremony. So I'm excited about that one. Like, it's possible that this is the house and this is the temple, but I don't really know. Anyway, okay, I obviously, I can't solve this yet. I wish I could. I felt like I was, based on how symbols correspond, instrument music with a symbol added, yes. So like that's accurate. Like the grave is to the left. This is saying S is to the right. So if we go this way, it should tell me what S is. So S is like pots or pl plants, right? I don't know. I'm gonna put it down here so I don't forget. And so that seems accurate that that's plant. And that's grave. So the question is, is, let's go to this again. This one, the sun with a diamond is forward. So let's see what it is. Okay, so it's like this house. Oops. I think I, it's the sun in a house. So it's that. So I actually think the right page is now accurate. So the question is, is what's the left page? Yes. Okay. All right, garden, church, cemetery, abbey. Technically, I got none of those words right. I called this plant, <laughs> religion place, grave, and outside. But like, whatever, like cl close enough, right? We're actually pretty close to being done. Like, how much could be possibly left at this point? The bone dome. <sighs> we are close. God, stop, poo. <laughs> this doesn't sound right. I've obviously made some assumptions with language here. <laughs> Lord, I don't want to poop anymore. <laughs> Hear me. Seventy-five Thank words you. for fun. We're close. I'm like, we're so close.
god, stop, <laughs> Oh, no. Um... So, like, that's why I was putting prey here. Because, like, is that what's happening here? Are they praying? But... Maybe not. And also, what was with all the skulls? No, 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 I didn't want to go in. I wanted to look at it again. So you can talk to people, but you don't understand what they're saying. That's kind of what's interesting about it. Yes. What does it mean? God, give me an answer. Uh, let me, let's talk to somebody, because sometimes they will say stuff to you. Mm -mm. Okay, so no, not having it. <sighs> I want to talk to God. I seek, uh, talk, pray. I, that last word might be wrong. <sighs> me, stop, find, pray. So that doesn't sound right. I actually think maybe stop is the wrong oh. word. like the light or something it's really interesting it makes me completely question all of this I don't know anything about poo yet I don't know how I even got that word that's like probably way off Like, those are right. These are wrong. I have six symbols left and I have six holes. Like, we can fucking solve this with the information that's in front of us. Six circles, six holes. Like, we can do this. I felt in my core that this was stop, but now I'm starting to like question like my knowledge here. It could be wrong. All the time. Oh, God, I feel so silly. Like, we're close, but not. We're close, but no cigar. Like, we're close. How did you get the information about the symbols? Well, every time I come across a symbol, I add it to my handy dandy notebook. So like, for example, I looked at this and the first time I looked at this, it said nothing because I didn't know what any of those symbols meant, but I wrote those symbols down in my notebook. And over time, it would give me clues that would say like, you have enough to know what these are. But you need to like solve it a little bit. So like here's a person I'm going to talk to. They're looking at this plant. And they say. 
pray, stop, garden. We know garden is accurate, but pray and stop might not be. Me, stop, find, pray. Sun, sun, poo. <laughs> That's probably not accurate. Me, stop, love, like, sun, sun, poo. And I, I don't believe any of this is accurate. Um, I'm going to try and record a Kennedy this week with Mike. I already asked him when he's free. Yeah, it's my hope that I can do it today. Or not today, this week. So there should be a new one this week. Barring Mike's schedule, because I have time for it. So if there isn't one, it's Mike's fault. <laughs> nah, I, I've, uh, I've tried to find a time where he's free, so... We're like four weeks to his wedding, so I know he's kind of slamma jammed. He already like uh, messaged me and was like, I am very busy with the wedding. I know he's got a lot going on, but I will do my best to, to make it happen. This makes me feel like stop isn't right. And pray isn't right. And poo isn't right. I think I already have a word for help. Help is the phone. So it's not help. Oh, and I, let me, I feel like you guys are missing. Let me shrink my body down a little bit here. I'll just put my body on the other side there you go so like we don't need to discover help anymore so that's not right i'd like to remember like obviously poo isn't the last part of this sentence Isn't sun symbol in the garden? Oh, let's look. Are you talking about here in this garden? I wish there was more signage. I found the lens. The lens found God. I'm going to the cemetery. Me go to temple or whatever. Who seems right? I don't know. Like, me putting in fake words has done so much harm to my, to my learning in this space. But we're so close. We're so freaking close. I make instruments. Do you like music? See, like, we've discovered that one. Potions. Keys. Vases. Like, I've solved this area. This area is clean. But I can't fucking figure out poo. <laughs> It's driving me nuts. It's obviously like closer than I think. I used the coin. I gave it to the person on the street. Oh, God, I'm so fucking close. I just need to like know what poo means. 
I should never have named it that. That's like on me. mean I'm I'm really close you guys and it's it's killing me. Well, I've already solved so it wouldn't ask you to use the symbols again. So cemetery's been used. Like it doesn't I don't it cemetery's done. If that makes sense. Like I don't I don't need I no longer need the answer to cemetery. I need this answer. This is the problem. <laughs> Stop is not accurate and poo is not accurate. This is our issue. This is the house of God. It is trying to explain something to me and I'm mess and it's and I'm wrong. Oh my god, I did it. That is plant. That is death. And that is preacher. All right. Here we go. Now we only have three left. No way. It can't be. That was up. I thought it was temple. Wow. Yeah, I'm just like shoving words in there. And you know what's crazy? I fucking know all the words and I still don't know what to do now. Ow. Ew. Okay, I was way off. I can talk to the plant guy now. Smart. Preacher is not in the garden. I can't find the preacher. Plants are dying. I don't like dying plants. I mean, that's not helpful. Where's the preacher? At least I can understand people now. Is the preacher going poo? <sighs> okay, so they don't know where the preacher is. Mm -hmm. 
I I was so confused. I thought they were all trying to like find God. And then, up symbol, I don't, I, yeah, I was confused by that too. And so we have this, but I don't know what to, oh, wait. Does that work in those rooms? Sorry, I know I'm all over the place. God. I think I understand. A little bit. A little bit. Not a lot of it, but a little bit. Because I have this key. Will that work in here? Devotee, love, poo. I mean, I don't know if that's right. What am I doing now? This fucking game. Oh! Devotee looks at God. All right, we're getting it. We just have to, we're just brute forcing it. I was like, I don't understand. Symbol. I did not understand. It is fun to see it click. I just don't. Oh my God. That's the answer to the graveyard. Man looks at devotee or whatever. These are all connect. This is all connected. Conspiracy. All right, so now we go to the graveyard. To the graveyard! We're so close. Okay, here we go. Man looks at devotee. Preacher talks to man. Um, man looks at devotee. Preacher 
looks at man. Oh my god, I already fucking uh, did that. All natural. God looks at the instrument. The div the div the devotee looks at God. Uh, I think I did it wrong. Oh, instrument. God looks at the instrument. Finally. Oh my God. Yes. 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 Fire, 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 fire. <laughs> Just like running around with this fire. <sighs> what am I doing with it? I have no idea. Looks pretty long, doesn't it? Oh, the preacher. He's dead. Is that what we're learning? I have turned on something. So I found the preacher. He don't, oh, he don't look good. And whatever this pipe is, I turned it on. Okay. Okay, so these people want to come in and they can't. Oh, this is a totally different environment. And it's like... Is this what it is? Like I'm I'm going to a different area, like a different level. Look how tiny I am. Okay. I have no idea. Ah! Run away. <laughs> okay, so they don't want to talk to me. Alright, so this is like area two. I feel like this is a good place to stop. What a cool game. Uh, I was very overwhelmed and not very good at it, but I do think I learned a lot and I think I got decent towards the end of it. Like I feel like I understood a lot of it towards the end. Um, I wish I had a bit of more of a knack for this type of puzzle. I really struggle with language puzzles, but I did 
I did get through the first area. Do I need to save? Does this auto save? It's probably fine. That was Chance of Sinar. I think it's pretty cool. Um, and uh, I really liked it overall, even though I was bad at it. That's how I felt about uh, most a lot of puzzle games that I play on stream, which is like, that was really cool. I was very stressed out and felt like I looked like a ding dong on my live stream, but you know, what are you gonna do? Um, let's find ready. someone to raid everyone. Cyanide, thank you for OMG, subbing. OMG Cyanide underscore 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 subbed. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. And I appreciate all of you hanging out with me on this Monday. I love streaming on a Monday. It's very nice. Um, I am going to raid someone right now. I think I'm going to raid Andy Cortez. Please give him your love. He's playing Armored Core. Have a wonderful evening, everyone. And I will see you on the next stream. Happy Monday. Have a wonderful week, okay? I'll see you on the next one. Yeah, the show is over, you guys.